Honorable Member for Lac de Bonny. The member for Lac de Bonny needs to unmute his mic. I've got the double mute on here, Madam Speaker. So here we go. Thank you, Madam Speaker. I thank my PC team for the opportunity to rise today to speak about the great sport of curling and to promote Manitoba Curling Week, which will take place this coming January 17th to the 23rd. Our family has been immersed in the game for quite some time. My wife, Tracy, and I, along with our boys, Braden and Jarvis, our siblings, our parents, have all been involved in the game for many, 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 many years. This is no different than thousands of stories of families across this great province of ours who absolutely love the sport of curling. We also have many members in the House that have or do participate in the sport of curling, including our Justice Minister and our Premier, who both have a provincial championship to add to their extensive resumes. Madam Speaker, curling, just like every sport, has been affected by this coronavirus. Curl Manitoba's Executive Director, Craig Baker, along with his staff of Tracy, Elaine, Lori, Connie, Rob, Amy, and Kristen, had provided their affiliated clubs with the return to play guidelines over the summer. The clubs had been adhering to these guidelines and were thrilled to be back on the ice for October. Curl Manitoba has been diligent on keeping the clubs informed on changes and updates since COVID began in March, and I am proud to be part of a government which introduced the bridge grant funding to aid businesses, recreation centres and not-for-profits during this difficult time. All November and December events have been postponed until the new year. Those will be rescheduled once they resume curling in this province. All provincials are still scheduled to happen for now, but the provincial Scotty has been pushed back two weeks from the original date. The Manitoba Open, the largest bond spiel in the world, has been postponed for now and hopefully will be rescheduled for later on in this season, depending on the pandemic. I was thrilled that our provincial government declared the third week of January every year as Manitoba Curling Week, and I continue to encourage all members of the Legislative Assembly to visit and support their local curling clubs. Let's hurry hard and sweep out the virus so we can get back to the sport so many people love. The Until member's time has expired. Leave. Leave Oral questions. Oh, is there leave to allow the member to complete a statement? Leave has been granted. The Honourable Member for Lac de Bonny. Thank you, Madam Speaker, and thanks to the uh, Assembly. Let's hurry hard and sweep out the virus so we can get back to the sport so many people love and give last year's championship teams a chance to defend their titles. Thank you, Madam Speaker, and I ask leave to be able to enter the list of Curl Manitoba's Board of Directors as well as their names of their staff into Hansard. Is there leave to include those names in Hansard? Leave has been granted.